So the album's called Whorls. Whorls like you would see in a plant or in a lot of different natural formations. The music itself was born out of this desire to connect with uh, in the internal voice and let that override whatever voices might be more, more present. This record is really, in a lot of ways, it's a band record. It's, uh, that's why we're calling it Kittle & Co. Really reflecting that we're this collective, it's featuring not only the individual players, but also this kind of uh, group collective mentality and, and sound. It's been a creative process that has involved all of us over the course of a few years to really get to where it's at now. With prior projects, the focus has been really so much on the the violin and the fiddle kind of out front in a lot of the music. Um, and in this, we're moving more towards this kind of group sound where everybody contributes. Somewhere in the middle of the five of us in the air, you know, the, the sounds are connecting and they're commingling. And when it's really happening, they're just totally one. They're just combining and making this, this incredible sound together. <laughs> So we found, uh, through some friends, we found this amazing studio up in Springfield, Mass. And our friend Warren Ammerman bought this old church, this old uh, 100, 200 years old. And he just spent the last 10 years retrofitting it into this amazing studio. So we holed up there for about a week and a half. We got the benefit of having the high ceilings. We basically recorded in the sanctuary where you can hear the reverberations up in the, the rafters and, and all throughout. And so that's a really strong element in this project as well, in, in this album, is getting to mix that in with our acoustic sounds, the close mic sounds, and also really the sound of the church. We even uh, used one of the organs as well. It was there on, on one of the later tracks that Nat played a beautiful organ part. I have so much respect and, and just admiration. I mean, these are the players who I want to be around as much as possible. They're the kind of players who really inspire me. And so getting to write and to kind of be, you know, get these pieces, get these tunes together for us to play uh, is a total honor. I mean, it's, it's a huge honor and we're all pushing each other and we're all inspiring each other. And in the end, you know, after uh, a few different versions and trying this, trying that, we're really happy with how they turned out. Mm -hmm. 